Hey there, Magus Academy students. This is your headmaster, Professor Magus, and welcome back to Let's Play Wild Arms. Last time we arrived here at the Maze of Death and um, moved some puzzles around. We'll move some statues for a puzzle. And today, we're going to finish up the dungeon. Um, let's see. Uh, Rudy needs a little bit of TLC right there. So we'll go ahead and give him some of that. Give him some of the berries, yo. Alright, so... See. Well, that did not go well. Uh, let's see. Where's the. There we go. Because being ambushed is not the best freaking thing in the world. So let's go ahead and click you. So, um. As you guys know, I've started, um. Okay, now that we're back, um, you guys notice that I changed the schedule again. Oh, I got apples I need to use, so go ahead and use those right now. I'm still gonna give the power apples to Rudy, but, um, even though he's stronger than Jack right now, so, it just... Um, I'm pretty sure that Jack will be getting more powerful equipment than what he has right now, like way later in the game, so it, it's just going to be really, really, um, so Jag is probably going to be more powerful than Rudy towards the end game, but it really doesn't matter at this point right now, but um, let's go ahead and pick this up. So, the crystal butt is what we're looking for, but we have three minutes to get out of here, but we're not going to leave just yet, so, but we're going to be casting escape. And wait, now you want to press up to uh, proceed back into the dungeon. Do not leave the dungeon if you're looking to get every single scroll, um, every single crest graph. Um, just so you know, the save point isn't here anymore, which kind of sucks, but it just doesn't matter right now. Um, oh, what the heck? And as you can see, the timer has stopped during battle, so um, that actually is a good thing. Unlike in Final Fantasy VII, when you do um, certain missions, like in the beginning, you know the bombing mission, that you go with Barret. Um, time still goes as, um, as you're fighting uh, monsters in Final Fantasy VII when time starts going. It, it, it's also the same thing with Final Fantasy VIII. So, um, I may not LP any more Final Fantasy games now that I think about it. I actually may livestream them instead, like when I get a computer that is more stable. So, let's go ahead and, you know what? I don't care, Hampan. I'm using you to get Crest Graphs. There you go. Now, down over here, you want to head up here, see that light? Let's see, um, yeah, we're good on everything, so without further ado, let us go ahead and go towards that beam of light, which is boss time against chaos. The god of discord? Nah. Totally a different game here, so what I want to go ahead and do is I want to start cracking down on Meteor Dive and have Rudy use a, um, use one of those cards there to get, um, to get us going. So, um, also I want to cast Awaken, which is a passive spell, you know, it doesn't go away after a certain amount of turns, which is really nice. So... It's a good thing that we did that too, because we were silenced, if I am correct. Ooh, not bad. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and have Rudy attack, Jack continuously use Meteor Dive, and then, yeah, the Violet Rose Cure Silence. I'm not so worried about Rudy being silenced, because um, using his arms really doesn't count as spells because they're bullets and they're physical beings. So, um, 
Let's see, what are you gonna do? Purple Electric is one of, um, Chaos's single, most dangerous single target attack, so I would deeply advise you guys to be a tad bit careful. But what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna cast Slow Down on Chaos and see if, um, she's affected by it. So, yeah, I believe in, um, in Wild Arms, Chaos is a she, not a he. Even though I think Chaos shouldn't have a gender. Um, there are some... Okay, there we go. Very nice. Like a boss. I've been watching so much Jacksepticeye, it's not even funny. So, let's go ahead. Actually, do I have... Yes, I have the St. Rune equip. So, let's go ahead and show off uh, Rudy's Guardian. Oh my... Okay, my Irish roots are kicking in right now because I've been watching so much Jacksepticeye. It's not even... Funny. So, um, let's see. I want to go ahead and... You know what? I can spare a potion berry. Let's go ahead and heal up Jack. So, um... I said this so many times. I am German and Irish. Okay, so you're going to cast Sleep. And then... Ha-ha! <laughs> Let's try that again, shall we? Um, let's see. I'm gonna cast Awaken again. And hopefully that will, um... Make things easier. Um, I actually do kind of want to cast Slowdown again. On, uh, Chaos just to be safe. But here's Ion Paula. I believe Chaos is weak to a Holy Attribute, so... That'll make things a little bit easier. Uh, not the best, but got the job done, so we're going to just keep um, using shite. We're just going to have Rudy increase his force points, and then we're going to go ahead and then, um, let's see. And after Rudy's force points have increased a little bit, we're going to be uh, blasting chaos with hand cannons all around. Hand cannons for days! So. So you're going to cast Purple Electric. Going to deal some nasty damage. And then we're going to use a Meteor Dive like a boss. You know what? Let's have Cecilia summon Stoldart. See if that does anything. So it seems that things have been going stupendously well so far, which... It's what I really, really like when I'm recording a video and things are going my way. Everybody likes it when things go their way when recording a video. So, oh, 375, that's actually not too bad. It's better than what uh, Rudy did with Ion Paula. So, let's see. We're going to have to heal up Jack. Um, let's see. Accelerator really isn't going to help at this point because... Um, you know, Chaos is super slow now, so which is really good. But eventually I'm going to have to use a healing carrot. I mean, a magic carrot. So that Jack can continuously... Did I... Oh, son of a bitch. Why? I thought I pressed the... I thought I selected Lock On. Sneaky little bastard that is. Okay, so instead, we're going to have Rudy use a Violet Rose, and then Jack can... Let's see if Deno Genos can do anything, but we're going to have Cecilia summon Stoldark, so this round is summoning round. So I think um, Chaos has like about 10,000 hit points or something like that, so it's a pretty long boss fight, so... Deno Genos did like 200 hit points of damage, which is still better than Ion Paula, but. Ugh. Okay, who are you gonna cut? Ooh, ouch. Okay. I suppose I'll use. Have Rudy use a heal berry, and then we'll continuously use Meteor Dive. And then why not? Let's magic carrot Jack. 
Let's be safe and use a magic carrot. So we're gonna have to have Cecilia cast heal on Rudy cause Nope, don't summon Guardian. Because the heal berry did not do much. That is for sure. So that did so much better than what we had. And ouch. Oh no, Gamma Ray is her strongest attack. Shite. Stop murdering Rudy, damn it! Ha! Victory! Like a boss! Man, the explosion is loud. And look at that, we got 3,000 Gela for that. Very nice. Death, death, death. It isn't as yet, 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 but a new beginning. Our civilization, bound by chaos, has turned the world into a temple of death. Where nothing survives. Innocent one, release me from this land and use my powers to revive the dying land of Philadelphia. Okay, we get the death room, so let's go ahead and get the hell out of here. Bye bye, we're never gonna see this dungeon again. So, you know what? Let's go ahead and use a violet rose on Rudy. And let's go ahead and equip the Death Rune to Cecilia because that actually increases her sorcery and magic rates or something like that. Her MGR, whatever that stands for. Um, if any of you know what that stands for, let me know or I'll just go into, um, after recording I'll go into the digital manual of this game and then, um, leave it in the description or something like that. So let's go ahead and reload our ammo. And before anything else... Go ahead and find some magic. Do one a wind spell. And then You know what? Let's get the sleep spell. Why the heck not? really need to go to the inn because we could just simply go to the pub and you have the crystal bud I need it really bad I can't explain things right now will you sell it for 500 gel no sure why not the crystal bud is a token of engagement in these parts I'm a fish out of water when it comes to these things it's nice to meet you I'm Captain Bartholomew Hey, Bartholomew, short as usual, eh? That's a That's crystal, a crystal blood. blood! When did, when you? did you? By the way, I think this is kind of like anime where, um... Where... Or the screen darkens and then the character starts thinking in deep thought like that. <laughs> Good timing, Drake. Care to smell my crystal blood? I bet that means his butthole. No, no. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, Barthy, but even if you have the crystal bud, you still need a mate. Where do you think you're going to find someone to marry your ugly mug? Are you blind? 
She's standing right next to me. You dumb baboon. Oh, her? I didn't notice. She looks way older than your preferred age group. Of course her. I'm sorry she's above your normal standards. I mean, having two legs and all. We're getting married soon. Good. We'll hold the wedding tomorrow then, okay? Okay, there you have it. I look forward to tomorrow's festivities. Oh, and there's... He's just dragging his mates away from Rufflin. Initiate the ruffle copter. Ruffle, 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 ruffle. <laughs> I did it again. Me and my big mouth. <laughs> what in the world are you going to do now, old boy? Excuse me, we're on our way to... We must go through with it. The wedding! I must deceive them, or I'll be left out of town. No, you don't mean... You shouldn't lie. You know I can't. It's too late. You're in on this till the end. Either way, we will think you were in, in on it on my scheme. I shall give you the tour of my ship, sweet candy. We must plan for tomorrow. Uh-oh, looks like we're stuck in quite a pickle. So, we're finally on my ship, sweet candy. There are many special rules the sailors of the inner sea must follow. One rule is for the group to provide a place for the ceremony to occur. Don't look at me, I feel guilty too. Well, the fake wedding is tomorrow regardless. You guys read up on our customs by tomorrow, okay? Oh, right, but we're... N I don't like this. We're here to look for the statue, not to get mixed up in all this. Give it up, princess. Because of this, we were able to get on board the ship. This is the only way to get to the statue. I think you're having too much fun. The wedding is tomorrow. Shouldn't you be reading up on the rules or something? That we should be, but that's not going to be today because I'm all out of time and Next time, we're definitely going to read up on the customs of the weddings in the inner sea. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and leave a thumbs up. Leave comments in the comment section below. And please don't forget to follow me on all forms of social media that are listed in the description. And if you guys are new to my channel and want to join Magus Academy, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. With that being said, this is your headmaster, Professor Magus, signing off. And I hope you guys have a fantastic day.